Hey there guys, welcome to another video. So uh, I just wanted to make a real quick video on how to restart your Roku TV. So I had an issue with mine recently where I had a streaming player on my HDMI 2 and it showed a blank screen. So no matter what I did, I tried to reboot that device, I tried to unplug it, replug it in, I had the same issue, just a blank black screen. I did try it on another device, on another TV, and it worked fine, so I figured there might be an issue with the TV. Now, being that this is a Roku TV, they try to keep the system up all the time so that even if you turn it off and on, the Roku portion of the TV is ready at all times. So if you have an issue with slowness or you have an issue with a blank HDMI screen, that kind of thing, uh, this might help you. So what you're gonna do is basically reboot the system. So you wanna go down to your settings menu, go down to your system. Once in there, keep going and go down to your power session, uh, section. Under that, you wanna go down to system restart. And what this will do is actually reboot the system here. So your TV will turn off temporarily and then turn back on. And as you can see, this is taking quite a while. So that's why it's usually up all the time so that when you turn the TV off and on, it doesn't take forever to boot it up. Okay, and here we are back at the TV menu. So whatever input you had on there, if you have that setting, it'll go back to the input that you had. So now that we're rebooted, you can go ahead and try whatever you're trying to do and you should hopefully have success. So hopefully this helped you uh, to get your TCL or whatever Roku TV you have working again. Anyway guys, thanks for watching. Hope you liked the video.